former cop came into this house, which I don't think was a coincidence, and now we're roommates together. I'm like, what the fuck? And then Luke, we were roommates together, and then he turned out to be an undercover actor for the show, and me, I thought he got pulled out because like he he um, got in too deep, and they replaced him with a similar substitute with Connor, who is like a little similar to Luke in many respects, and now we're roommates again. Like me and Luke were roommates, now me and Connor are roommates. And, uh, and then all of a sudden, Ted disappeared randomly with no explanation. We didn't even see him leave. We didn't say goodbye. Then Smack disappeared. No explanation. We didn't say goodbye. Alyssa decides to leave immediately after the whole twist fish tank thing was revealed. But we don't know what happened. We don't know if she made it home. And then LeBron just dipped from the, the cell challenge as if he knew what this was, the cell thing, and wanted to get out of there immediately. And now I suspect Sybil, like... I mean, it was being so mean to Sybil, I thought, like, maybe it's because, like, I'm trying to think, like, what type of thing would, I think his accent, I think maybe he might be undocumented, and then they're trying to catch him revealing it so that they'll be sent away, just like all these others were sent away. Ian's the only one that was actually voted off, but I feel like the voting thing is just a pretense, and when more people are leaving through mysterious means than actual voting. Want a clue? Yeah, what is it? Have you ever heard of an Indian prison gang? Indian prison gang? Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't know. I heard like Colombian drug lords, that type of stuff. But have you ever heard? You've heard of black prison gangs, yeah. Hispanic prison gangs, yeah. white prison gangs. Yeah. Have you ever heard of an Indian prison gang in America? I don't think so. Right. So that's the clue. That's your clue. Yeah. Since regarding symbol. Okay. Right. There's okay. There's not been an Indian prison gang as far as I can aware of. Mm -hmm. So there are none. Okay. There's no Indian prison gangs in America. Zero. Okay. So therefore this is not really some type of like weird criminal undercover reality show. Could be. Alright. But if it is, symbol's not a prisoner. Okay, he's not a prisoner. Now, do you want to place a bet on who we're bringing in next as a freeloader? Okay, like... What type of person? Is it like who I hope we can have or is what we'll most likely have? What do you think we'll have? Well, the first three um, freeloaders, okay, are straight white males, so... I'm, if it was not a straight white male, I guess that'd be too obvious. So I'm hoping either a female or someone of color. Okay. Any other details? Um, I assume probably around my age, 30s or above. Okay. Yeah. So this two beds where they can sleep. Okay, interesting. Um, um, I, how much to bet? Um, what's the minimum? Is that 40? 40. Okay, then, um, like, who's in the lead right now with all this bet thing we're doing? Not you. It's time to risk it all. Okay. Did you have a gambling problem? Yes. Kick um, ass. Let's go. What did you gamble on? Um, I made some like risky investments. Yeah. Like s day trading type of stuff. Like what? What did you invest in? Um, uh, really volatile like stocks that um, where like it would go high one minute and then decrease the next. Was this during the GameStop stuff? Because we did that. GameStop. GameStop um, and AMC. It, the issue about penny stocks, um, it kind of reached a peak like around what was it, 2000 and, uh, 2018. Mm -hmm. Um, that's when it like it reached a peak where I had to like um, go get um help mm -hmm. getting Gamers Anonymous. I was there for a while and then the pandemic happened and then we couldn't go to the meetings anymore. And now the pandemic, I kind of just stopped going. Yeah, did you so you lost money. 
Um, Gideon lost, lost all his weight. Neon lost. Neon, you lost, yeah. 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 I think it's time to reawaken that. Um, the thing is, um, I don't want to do anything problematic that can, like, reactivate the gambling issue by making bets. Yeah, that's why I think it might be important for you to make bets. Uh, I don't understand. Just bring that back. You have to, like, so this is something we have to do. Yeah. Even if I don't want to. Yeah. Just like I went to fight Sybil, even if I didn't want to. Yeah. So in the end, here, I'm going to have to do things that I don't want to. Yeah. In order to make it into the end. Yeah. Okay. And you see, think about it, though. Masculine black male fighting. Yeah. Gambling. Yeah. I mean, it's like I said. Oh, right. This is a stereotypical thing. Yeah. That we were... supposed to do okay so much like this other thing like we're supposed to have big stuff mm -hmm. and um, be built strong mm -hmm. okay you can just make one bet and okay. not worry about it okay how much you want to bet um what happens if I lose it all nothing nothing okay probably okay might get eliminated oh dear okay then if you lose real bad, they might even not buy you a plane ticket home. I'm just kidding. That's okay. true. Okay. So that is true for Symbol though. So if Symbol loses all his things, don't tell him that. Don't repeat that. All right. How much you want to bet? Okay. Um. Forty. Come on. <laughs> okay. Um. What's the max I can bet? All of it. Or just tell. I'm surprised he hasn't discovered crypto. It's like the perfect match. I'm coming. Okay. Okay, freeloaders here. One second. What do you got here? Okay, let me, let me see this. Yeah. yeah. Blank. So we got 100, 200, 300. What the fuck? This is 100, yeah. 200, 300, 310. Okay, Bert's betting 310. The next will be a female oh, that's of color, 30s or older. What? Can you go grab... Actually, you know what? The free look is here. I'm going to grab them. Thanks, Bert. Good job. Okay. Thank you.